Okay, hello, my name's Jude Fullen. Uh, I'm a prototyping expert and technologist. Um, I've worked at companies like Dyson and Lego and startups like Sugru, and always I've been trying to bring complex ideas to life, quite often with simple visual things uh, like using cardboard. Um, I've also become a dad recently, and uh, I thought it was kind of interesting that these two sort of worlds seem to have collided, and that even at Dyson we'd create prototypes for things out of cardboard to understand the user experience and now I kind of feel like I'm creating things like this little bus which uh, has been an awkward moment borrowing this from my little boy for two minutes and then I have to give it back um, but there's just nice little features of using the the card for things like this and I've got instructions of how to build this below so I started off building things like that and then of course things like this cardboard mask which you know you can see a little bit of battle damage from the uh the, the there's two of these uh so it's just been really fun to see these and what i love about this is that both of these models uh the first one was made just from a couple of apple boxes and this was made mostly using a stapler and a little bit of tape um because i was very deliberately trying to show how you don't need to use advanced materials to achieve something that's still a lot of fun um and of course, given the circumstances of the minute, even more so. Um, even though I think there's some things which, you know, you can work up to, like I did a much more sort of advanced show PC type of rocket like this, um, which has a little working lift going inside it, so you can see it there. And I think it's just always fun for me to try and explore the notion that you don't have to buy these big plastic toys. Um, which ultimately run a small amount of time and in many ways I think you know one of the most profound things I learned at Lego was that it's it really isn't the end destination it really is the journey of you building something with your kid that is you know completely over indexes any other thing you can gift them um, and I think that's why cardboard so lovely is I think it underscores that point of the the resource is minimal yet the outcome can be quite you know elaborate like this but I appreciate I've got 10 years of experience of doing this. So for me, this is, you know, comparatively easy, though there is guides on how to do this. But I also started somewhere and I thought this was a really great <coughs> beginning. And so what this is, this is a little ramp that you can put cars down. And this has been hours of fun just with one piece of cardboard. And all it is, is to, you know, cutting out a piece here again from Apple boxes and sticking two side pieces on. So yes, you do need a ruler and you do need a good scalpel or craft knife. But honestly, this is very, very achievable, even for the most beginner of parents. The bit that I think, you know, you can sort of see is the engineering part in me is that I've also incorporated some coffee stirrers into a little chunk of the cardboard here and then made a socket. And the reason being is because these things can join together now. And so you can see even more epic. And so we've managed to get, there's actually one of these which got jumped on, but this was like even bigger again. So it's this big. And again, let's be honest, space is a premium. Uh, not everyone has the luxury of a garden these days. So being able to pack it down, I think is also really, really useful. So I wanted to show that as really, this is, this is an entry level, it gets you started, and honestly, the, the, the attachment that my son has to this, and I haven't even been able to take his little cardboard sword, because he desperately wants to play with that this morning. So um, I'm going to go give these back now, and I'll include some links in the bottom, and I hope you'll enjoy learning a few tips and tricks, but really, the, the biggest thing I can stress at this time, it's not about spending loads of money on stuff. It's definitely about trying to find that time where you're building together and, as, as the phrase implies, learning through play. It really is that. It doesn't have to be all about the sort of heavy uh, agenda. It's just about having fun. There's a huge amount to be learned from even, should we say, the physics and the building and the discussion, even making something as simple as this. So I hope that inspires a little. And uh, please subscribe. Uh, like it, share it if it's something that you think yourself or any other parents uh, would like, or indeed just for yourself. Thanks again. Bye.